Hi everyone, uh, good to be back. Uh, this is uh, kind of our Mother's Day show. I'm happy here to have my mom Helen, who's my my favorite person in the world. She doesn't know it, but we tend to cry when we get this emotional. <laughs> and um, and she brought me this apron this morning. You like the apron, Mom? I, I like the apron. It. I love it. I love mine too. So today we're going to do two real simple recipes for Mother's Day. Um, these are a couple of recipes that we have in the restaurant. We do uh, fettuccine carbonara and we do uh, brown butter pasta as well. And you'll see my mom is a perfectionist so she doesn't uh, stray from the pan too often because she's uh, attention to detail. Um, so mom's going to do the brown butter pasta and I'm telling you these recipes are so easy to do. Um, I grew up on this recipe. I love this recipe. And I remember when mom used to say we're having macaroni with cheese and uh, simple. Mizitra. Yeah, simple. Mizitra cheese. Is, yeah. It's uh, Greek cheese. Um, it's a hard cheese like Parmigiana is, Parmigiana Reggiano. But uh, it doesn't nearly have the uh, scent, I guess, that Parmesan cheese does. And mom, you got some butter going? Yes, right there. Pure butter. Real butter. Yes. Not margarine. No. Well, home I use margarine. I like margarine better. I'm honest with you. Here, we're using butter. So, the so what's the key to you brown have butter pasta? You to burn the butter, very burn, and then you put the spaghetti in and you mix it. Then you take it out and you put the mijitra. Right. It's the Greek cheese. Yeah. And you serve it. But it has to be, the butter has to be burned. That's right. And that's why it's called brown butter yes, pasta. Yes, and that's how it tastes. And better. actually, when the when the butter actually goes brown, um, there's just a, a key moment there before it actually really burn burns. You'll see it starts to defoam a bit, and that's where all the flavor comes in. And your butter actually turns nutty, and that's what gives it all the flavor. I'm going to stay out of Helen's way because she knows what she's doing. I'll be her sous chef. I know it looks like maybe the butter is starting to burn, but it isn't. That's what tastes better. And so we've already parboiled our pasta. So we've taken the mijitra cheese, which is hard like Parmesan, and we've grated it already. So did we put a little more cheese on top? Wow, simple, eh? Looks delicious, huh? It's Looks delicious. Spaghetti. It's a great spaghetti. <laughs> we'll just put this up here and uh, I'll do mine real quick. And so now it's my turn. Um, I've actually already browned some bacon here. Excuse my reach. And so I've got my bacon pretty crisp right now. And it depends how fatty your bacon is. Sometimes you might want to take some of the grease out and everything else, but I, I, I suggest you leave it in there. It's just nothing but flavor, so I would leave that alone. So chicken, uh, sorry, uh, fettuccine carbonara is what we're making today. So I already have one egg yolk in my bowl and I'm just going to do three more eggs for this recipe because it's a fair portion of a uh, pasta today. There we go. And so we have three eggs and one egg yolk and this is basically our sauce. So over here on this side, we got our bacon and the bacon's warm. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add a tiny bit more olive oil to it. There we go. 
all heated up. So now that it's all warm, I'm just going to add the pasta. And there's my fettuccine. And we're just going to toss them. So I just have a, I just grated some fresh parmesan. mixture that we had and we're going to toss it and back in the pan for about two or three minutes. I'm going to just add a little bit of salt and a tiny bit of pepper. Don't get any easier than that. Before you say it, let me give you this. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Oh, thank you. Love you. I love you too. Hope I don't poke you. There we go. So two of my favorite recipes. Real simple, real easy to do. I kind of want to eat hers, and she probably doesn't want to eat mine. That's no, okay. I like that too. Yeah. Shall we try it? I thought they should try it. <laughs> Not that we'll, well, that's okay. Happy Mother's Day, man. Thank you.